I am so freaking excited today because I'm going to get to eat jackfruit. So in this video, I'm going to show you what jackfruit looks like, what things that, well, what parts of the jackfruit that we should eat and what parts of the jackfruit maybe we shouldn't be eating. But like the seeds, I don't eat them, but I think that you can like roast them and cook them and eat them. But there's a lot of waste with jackfruit. So I'm going to show you what you actually eat and then I noticed that our hands get really, really, really sticky sometimes with jackfruit and I didn't really know how to get the stickiness off because when you wash them with water, it really doesn't work. I know how to get the stickiness off and I'm going to show you how to do that in this video also. Here's what jackfruit looks like and we paid 99 cents a pound. We paid 99 cents a pound. I have to keep focusing the camera, but it's 99 cents a pound. So it costs about $5 for all of this. Jackfruit can be kind of expensive, but whenever it's 99 cents a pound, we always make sure to buy some if it is available. And here's what the jackfruit looks like and then flip it over, Stephen, so we can see the other side. Open it up. Oh. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here's the jackfruit. Then flip it over, babe. And here's the outside of the jackfruit. What it looks like. Looks similar to durian, but no, it's not. Not really. No. <laughs> it's a little different. It's very different. It doesn't hurt, and it's not as sharp. Mm -hmm. Yeah, durian um, attacks Stephen and bites him apparently, and jackfruit's a little nicer, so that's why we buy jackfruit. <laughs> okay, so here's the close-up. So these are the seeds. Seeds, and I think you can eat those if you cook them, but I'm not really sure. We don't. And then this is the part that you can eat, and all this you do not eat. Core rind. It's really hard to cut one of these up. And so I have an amazing husband that does it for me. <laughs> He's really amazing. He is amazing. Uh, what we found out is the best is cutting off the rind and then just breaking it off the core because this thing... Hey, wait, this one's easier. <laughs> Great. The last time we got one, it was like, it was almost wood in the core. from the core and you can see all the sap it's extremely sticky almost like chewing gum this is the meat right here of the jackfruit and if you're wondering what jackfruit tastes like it is juicy fruit bubble uh, a juicy fruit bubble gum kind yeah. of taste yeah juicy fruit bubble gum kind of taste well some of it tastes like that and some of it doesn't it's like some of it is more sweet uh the in the 1950s, I think it was called Tutti Frutti. That is the actual flavor, I think, of, dirt, of jackfruit. jackfruit. And this is what you eat. So you can see all the pieces around the jackfruit that you actually eat. All this right here, you don't eat. All these little pieces. You're trying to get in here to get the, the meat of the jackfruit. Off the rind in the core yeah and the sap is extremely sticky yeah it makes it really sticky your hands really sticky but see i'm continually pulling away all the outer and then you have to take the seed out and then that's what you're left with and that's what you eat of it cut up 
and you can see all of the extra waste move back a little bit Pim. right here and that'll all be taken down to the compost and then here is our bowl of jackfruit it tastes like gum gum yeah but you've never eaten gum it doesn't taste like gum to you what does it taste like it does taste like gum does it taste like something else you've had any other kind of foods? Strawberries. It tastes like strawberries? Yeah. Anything else? No. That's no? It. That's it? Okay. I don't think it tastes like strawberries. Yeah. Well, she could think it tastes like strawberries. That's okay. Is it good? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so you were sitting on the couch waiting so patiently to get some of this, right? Yeah. You couldn't wait. Yeah. Yeah, mommy couldn't wait either. I don't blame you. Are you going to stand behind me when I talk? Okay, I'm going to record, but it is recording. But <laughs> So you guys are going to absolutely love this if you're like me, Stephen, stop. What you wash your hands with is coconut oil. Yay! So you get some coconut oil and put it on your hands. Put some on your hands, babe. Okay, I'm apparently, well, first y'all... Yeah, he's all yeah. sticky. Yeah. All sticky and messy. So then you just put some coconut oil on your hands and scrub, scrub, scrub for maybe about 60 seconds and then wash off with the water and that's literally it. And then you just kind of let the coconut water or the coconut just soak in your hands. And it cleans it all up. Well, I'm only halfway through. My hands would have been a lot dirtier being more than way through. There you go. That is the easiest way to clean your hands afterwards when you have that stickiness on your Ooh, hands. My hands are clean. Look. From the jackfruit. Good. Stop, Stephen. Okay. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel and give me a like. And if you have anything to say about jackfruit, let me know in the comments below.